Okay, let's take a look at finding the sample variance using GeoGebra. First, I'll type in my numbers. So I got 2, 8, 11, 17, 25. Now over here, I'll give it some kind of title, sample variance. And here, um, if I come down and look at my three little dots, Again, if you don't see it, you need to scroll down. We're looking for statistics. And if you uh, expand that, you start looking through all the different possibilities. I'm looking for variance. There it is, sample variance. So if I um, I have the sample variance there, comes up with a list of raw data. This is uh, all the different ways you could uh, use it. Now it should be some way you could just click on this and bring it over, but I haven't figured that out. Unless I drag it, no. How about if I do an equals first? Let me try to do an equals first, and then come over here. And uh, double click it, doesn't do any good. Right clicking doesn't do any good. Uh, I guess I just remembered sample variance. Okay, so if I come over here and I type equals sample variance, beginning parentheses, and then I'll do A1 colon A5. Um, so I type in exactly as you see it there. Notice I made those uppercase A1 and A5. Now, if this doesn't work, I'm going to redo it a little bit differently. I think uh, GeoGebra is a little bit finicky on how you input in the formulas. And if I press enter, it actually worked that time. Um, I think it's when you put a lowercase a uh, that uh, you find out it doesn't, doesn't work consistently. But uh, that would be our sample variance.